Hi, Diana Patton here with a self-care tip to help you rise above your circumstances, to accept every single challenge as it comes, to be the most resilient person that you know, and to commit to living your very best life. One thing that I believe is so powerful is setting intention for the way that you will live. In other words, what are you inviting into your life? Setting an intention means being very specific. It's like having a compass on how your life is going to be directed by your thoughts and by your words. I love what Oprah talked about in her Wisdom of Sunday book. She quoted Joel Olstein, who happens to be a pastor, talking about the words, I am. The philosophy behind that was basically saying, saying I am tired or I am weary or I'm so stupid. Those types of words, when you say those words, what follows I am is likely what you are inviting into your life. Now, it's not saying that you're not tired. I mean, you likely might be tired because you didn't get enough sleep, but shifting that around and saying, I am purposeful, I'm joyful, I'm kind, I'm wonderful. All of those kinds of things have meaning. They have grounding. They're rooted in a sense of intention. So perhaps you might want to change your words, start putting a good compass and a good grounding into your life and setting the right intention. And in doing so, you'll be able to rise above your circumstances, accept every single challenge as it comes to be the most resilient person that you know and to commit to living your very best 